Hey guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Thursday, November 4th. 4th, 2021. And I am coming on here to announce the uh, recipients of our thank you gifts for all the donations that were made to Wings in October. So for those of you who are new here, my name is Rose. I like to crochet. I like yarn a lot and I make stitch markers. So please go check out my Etsy shop. And if you could do me a favor and hit the favorite button on there, I think it's a little heart and favorite a few items. I really do appreciate it. It does help me a lot. And um, this year, uh, oh, I live in the Chicago area. I have one daughter. Her nickname is Carrots, like the vegetable. And we have a bunch of animals in this place, so we call it the zoo. So this year, along with last year, you guys helped with a domestic violence organization that is based here in the Chicago area called Wings. Um, there is an entire playlist on my channel for all the Wings videos, the updates and information and stuff like that. And what we're doing is every month they have asked for specific handmade donations and we are giving away thank you gifts um, as a way to say thank you for donating. And a lot of those thank you gifts were donated. So um, so we do this every month and we will do this one more time for anyone who donates in November. And so I want to go over um, who the winners are and what the prizes are. And um, it's not really a winner. It's just like a thank you gift. So um, just to give you an idea of how many donations we had for the month of October, we had 295 donations. What? shut the front door. Are you serious? Like you guys rocked it in October. Um, and so I do have, what do I have here? I have 20 thank you gifts and I will tell you who won and, um, you guys can opt to not claim your gift. That's fine. Um, but today is the fourth and I will let you know that I need to hear from you no later than November 11th. Um, you, if your name is called, please send me an email with your shipping address. Now, if you don't hear from me, that's fine, um, but you have to send me your shipping address, and if you could tell me what you won, that would be great, um, but I won't be shipping anything out until after the 11th, So, because I'm not going to go to the post office 20 times for 20 different um, gifts to, to ship out, so I hope that's okay, so if you send me an email tonight or tomorrow and you don't hear from me, don't email me back until after the 11th, because after the 11th, I'll ship them out, and then I'll get you all tracking numbers. So <laughs> I hope you understand um, that that's the way it's going to go. Okay. And if you decide you don't want the gift, you don't have to email me. Just don't email me. That's fine. Um, so what happens is every time I get a package, I have a notebook and I write down the name and um, the address and kind of what was in the box and I assign it a number and it's it's just a, a number. Like the first person that I open the box is number one. The second person is number two. The third person is number three. So there's no special numbers assigned. Um, and then I use a random number generator. Usually it's my daughter, but she was not around to help me with the random number generator. Um, so I just did it like a random number generator from Google and I put in the number one through 295 and I just hit pick a number and it picked a number. And I went to my notebook where I had all the names written and I circled it and I put it, <laughs> I have a list of all the prizes and I just put it in order. However, the first person that got picked got number one, okay? So it was very, very random. So I hope you guys understand that. Okay, so um, like I said, I have 20 thank you gifts. Um, some of these are leftovers from last month because people didn't claim them. Some of them, there's a pattern in there, there's a book in there. Um, so some things will not get mailed to you, like physically mailed to you. But most of the things here I have, I will physically mail it to you. So um, remember, um, since today is the fourth, I'm giving you seven days to respond. Um, you have to email me roselikescrochet at gmail.com. You have to send me your mailing address. And please don't get antsy if I don't respond back to you. Um, nothing will be mailed out until after the 11th. Okay, so are you guys ready? <laughs> so I have everything here. So I'm going to show you everything and then call out the name so that you know who it is. Um, okay, so, and I can't read my own writing. <laughs> so glasses, guys. <laughs> All right, so the first item 
was actually donated by someone named Beverly and she actually donated um, this item last month but the person didn't claim it. So we have a $25 Amazon gift card and this is courtesy of Beverly. And the winner for this one is Dorcas Fields. Okay, the second um, item that we're giving away as a thank you, now these are all thank yous for you, for you guys who donated to Wings. Um, let me get the box for that. Okay, so someone didn't claim this for last month. It is this box filled with yarn. There is more stuff under underneath it. I don't know if you guys can see that. Anyway, so this is the yarn box. Um, I'm calling it yarn box one. And the winner for yarn box one is Janina Alvarado. Okay, so then the third prize is this pouch from Amy. That's anonymous Amy, and no one claimed this for last month, so it's a carryover. And the winner for this pouch for October is Sharon Donovan. And then we had some yarn that was donated, and I'm going to show you the yarn. Um, both of these packs were donated by the same person. So this person, whoever uh, I call out next, will get both bags of these. And the winner for those yarns are, is Stacy Robinson. Okay, and then we have a project bag by Crafty Bones. Hi, Jennifer. Um, she has a YouTube channel here, so go check her out. Um, no one claimed this project bag last month, so it is in the pot for this month. And this is the adorable octopus um, project bag by, by Jennifer at Crafty Bones. And the winner for this one is Renee Jones. And then we have another project bag by Jennifer at Crafty Bones. And it is this beautiful, you guys can't tell, but it's like shiny material. It's gorgeous. And the winner for this one is Linda Ogden. And then we have this makeup bag that was not claimed last month which is this right here. And the, these makeup bags were donated by Sharon and Linda. The winner for this one is Doreen Dubois, D-U-B-O-I-S. And then we have another makeup bag also donated by Sharon and Linda. And the winner for this one is Sandra Ward. So then I have this quilted bag by Mary Maxim, and this was also donated to me by someone. And uh, the note says, Rose, please use as a thank you gift. It's a Mary Maxim project bag and it's quilted. So um, this winner for this one is Barbara Schwar Schwarzentruber. Okay, and then I got this bag from Random Randy's Ramblings and I tried to give it away last month and the person didn't claim it. So this uh, bag goes to Melissa Davis. And then I had another one, um, this little triangle bag. Also, I purchased from Random Randy's Ramblings and the person last month did not claim it. So the winner for this bag is Sally Loss. And then I have a pattern from Brittany at Wool Makes. So that'll be any pattern I think in her Etsy shop. And the winner for that pattern is Vicki Graham. And then I have some stitch markers. Now this first set of stitch markers um, was donated by someone who wanted to remain anonymous. And um, these are my stitch markers. I'm the one that made them and she bought them from me so that she could give them to you as a gift. So the winner for these pink butterfly stitch markers is Ella at No Catchy Name. Oh my gosh, hi Ella, you guys go check her out. And then um, Tammy, also wanted to donate stitch markers and she picked a bunch of random ones and this set of stitch markers that um, is going out for this month are these ruby red slippers and the little disc says there's no place like home and the winner for those stitch markers, I made these as well, is Gert Kirkland and then we have a project planner book, which is from Laura at Crojo Corner, and I'll show you what it looks like. So this is the project planner, and Laura actually gave this one to me, but you will get one, um, and you get to pick out your own cover and all that other stuff, and she'll walk you through how to do that. So thank you, Laura from Crojo Corner for donating a crochet planner book for someone. And the winner for the crochet planner book is Shirley Spring. 
And then I have um, a set of crochet hooks and someone donated this to me and I hope that it is okay to donate these. Um, these are not the hooks that I particularly use. So um, I'm gonna give these away so you guys can see all of these crochet hooks in here. There's a lot. And the winner for these crochet hooks is Taisha Banks. And then we have a, I got gifted a bunch of amazing coin purses from Billy the Crafty Floridian. They're absolutely beautiful. I already have one that I use every day, um, but I have three more that I'm gonna give away. And um, I'm gonna show you the one. So this one right here, and I did not make these. This is from, these are made from Billy the Crafty Floridian. So Billy, I hope it's okay that I'm donating these um, as thank you gifts. Um, they're absolutely beautiful, um, but I already use one a lot. So um, I hope that's okay that I'm giving these away. Um, so this large purple coin purse is gonna go to Dina O'Connor, and she is from Dina's Homespun Fun. Hi, Dina, send me an email. And then I have a small one right here. Oh my God, like Billy is amazing. If you guys don't know Billy the Crafty Floridian, you gotta go check her out. The winner for this one here is Christy Dore, D-O-R-E. And then I have this amazing black one. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. And it's got stars all over it. Also made by Billy the Crafty Floridian. And the winner for this one is Sharon Geringer. And then I don't know if you guys saw um, the last, maybe the last Wings Update video or two of them ago, I don't know. But Dina from Dina's Homespun Fun, she donated all of these little accessory pouches and um, notepads, <laughs> words, you guys. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these in random thank you gifts. Um, so that they're kind of spread out amongst people. And so these will be a surprise. If you see one of these in your thank you gift box or bag, then you'll know that these came from Dina. So Dina, thank you for donating these. And then the last item that I always give away is something I call my goodie box. And I'm gonna show you, it's just in a small priority box. And for those of you who have been here for a while, you already know what's kind of in here, but I'm gonna show you what's in here. All right, you guys. So the first thing that's in this goodie box is um, this Lion Brand Pound of Love. And then I have two balls of Crafter Secret Cotton. And I think that's from, yeah, that's from Hobby Lobby. And then I have a pair of fuzzy socks because now we're getting cold. So, oh, there's three balls of that cotton, guys. Three balls of that, a pair of fuzzy socks. I have a fat quarter. I have one of these, what is it, a hobium bag. I have a notepad. That's awesome. And then I have this pin from Crochet Luna that says happiness is crochet. And there is a tea bag in there as well. And then um, Tori's, um, Tori from Polly's Creations, um, she donated one of these angel keychains for every goodie box that we're giving away this year. So that's gonna go in the box as well. And then um, you guys probably know this lady named Crystal at Bag O' Day Crochet. <laughs> She's an amazing, amazing person. I absolutely love her. I'm sure you guys know who she is. Um, I know you know what's coming, right? So um, when we started doing this and I said, hey, if anyone wants to donate prizes for thank you gifts, she said, well, I wanna donate my thumb drive. So she sent me thumb drives at um, like March or April for all of the goodie boxes. So I have Crystal's thumb drive. Now it, it has all the patterns that she had in her Etsy shop at the time. So if there's anything more recent, it won't be on here, but this will be everything since um, or from March or April and, and before. So if you win this goodie box and you don't know how to read patterns, you can tell me you don't want the thumb drive and I'll send it back to Crystal. But you have to tell me if you want the thumb drive or not, okay? So that will go in the box if you want it. And then I think you all also know what's coming <laughs> because Crystal has done this every month so far. So the person who wins this goodie box, um, Crystal, who is one of the most amazing souls that I know in my life, um, has also decided that she wants to donate a Michael's gift card. 
So you guys, this isn't just any Michael's gift card. This is for $100. So I would really appreciate it if you guys could make sure that you are subscribed to Crystal at Bag O Day. Watch her videos, watch the ads if you can. Watch her videos from beginning to end. Um, and go show her some love because she didn't have to give you guys a hundred dollars for donating to an organization that she has nothing to do with, but she, she's that kind of person. And she did. So this is going to go in the box. Okay. So I think that that is enough. You guys want to know who won the goodie box, right? Okay. So the random number picker chose Diane Meyer and the last name is spelled M I E R. Okay. So that is it. That's 20 thank you gifts. And it's not even enough for 295 people who donated 20 gifts does not seem like enough to say thank you for everything that you guys do for wings, but it has to be because I don't have anything else. So, um, I'm not going to list the winners in the description box. If you are not sure if your name was called, please go back and rewatch the video. Um, it would be awesome if you guys could say congratulations to everyone not because that they're winners of the thank you prizes, but because they donated to Wings. Um, and I really do appreciate it and everyone at Wings appreciates it too. So that is it. And I am so looking forward to getting boxes for November's donations. For those of you who don't know, it is Toys for Boys and Chunky Baskets. So remember anyone who was a winner tonight, you have until November 11th to send me an email with your mailing address um, to roselikescrochet at gmail.com. Please don't expect a response or a tracking number until after the 11th. And if you have any questions, let me know. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye.